Welcome to our first episode of Dragon Quest Builders Chapter. Um, I just did Caitlin. I'm recording now. I'm Caitlin, so let's do Ramona from the beginning. Let's do Ramona. Swamps of sickness. There. My child, you have awoken. This is the next place that cries out for your help. Ephraim, the land of Ramolta. Long ago, this island you see before you was home to a proper city, surrounded by crystal clear water. But now, all that has been corrupted by this blighted mine. The few survivors live in constant fear of a dreadful disease. Here, my child, I offer this gift unto you, unto you. Now I'm going to the town. I did all the job. At towards the night, you see before you, Ephraim, and plant this banner of hope in the center of the ruins. All may seem strange to you at first, child. The people you encounter here, the monsters you do battle with, even the new creations of And I know that you will soon find your feet in this afflicted frontier. Now go, Ephraim, and towards the Stupid banner already. A warm and soothing light spreads all around. My child, the people who inhabit this blighted land have lost hope. They live in constant fear of the disease that stalks all who live here. <coughs> Thanks to your effort. In Cantlin, my children are gradually regaining the power to build. However, the men and women of Romulda have not the strength to resist this epidemic and have but surrendered to the sickness. Ephraim, it will not be long before the banner site draws the survivors to this place. You must build a new town here and purify this polluted land. Do what you must to eradicate the land by the play by which it has gripped. And you know, my child, that I do watch over you always. Okay. Where is she? First person. Okay, there she is. Ellen. Heavens above! I never expected to find a poor, ailing patient in a place like this. What's the matter with you, my lamb? Does your stomach hurt or your chest? Or... Rubus forbid, is there something wrong with your head? What? There isn't anything the matter with you at all, but if that's the case, whatever are you doing in place like this? Well, I'll just say she is, but the person I'm talking to right now, Ellie, she is my favorite character. She is my favorite character out of all the characters in this game. Mercy me, except for her. Mercy me, you're the builder, the one with the power to create. Did you make this flag too? If you really are the builder, then the great shepherdess in the sky must have guided you here. Truly, the goddess does watch over us always. My name is Ellie. Please, my lamb, help me save this blind of land. She says, this poor blighted land. You guys can't see that. That's what she said. I know. This entire island is infected by the blight. Don't even say that all the sickness here is caught. And a left guard. It's concentrated. 
want to save this place, I want to heal each and every one of the poor spirits that's left in my village. Will you help me, Ephraim? Will you join me in fighting back against the sickness that plagues this land? I'm sorry, you want to know what happened to my leg? It was my own silly fault, really, and my hands to reach the light I saw shining down here. I tripped over and injured myself. If I had some healing cream to rub it, I'm sure it would get better right away, but I mustn't grumble after all. It is something, but I mustn't grumble after all. It, it's nothing compared to the suffering others are doing. If I had some healing cream, she says, which is just the dust. Which I don't like. I have to go all the way over here. Hey, look, from last chapter, Pippa gives you a pumpberry. Uh, I'm in the store that. It's called, I'm going to name it Pippa's Pumpberry. We're in the store, and it's all in the chest. Where do you say? I have to get up here somewhere. My first block of earth, I know, I just got a job. So anything I have to do that's different. Mm. No! Look at these guys. I hate these guys so much. Mm. Okay, I have to do the damage. Okay. And I might mean, want to collect a lot of these bushy things. Because I have... You have to travel such a long distance from base. Oh. My god. I'm just gonna collect all these. Oh, yeah. Okay, I need one more plant. I also need a basic. I'm probably gonna get Once I go and raid these ones. No, no, five. Ooh, six. Okay, so, six is the thing we're making. Six here. Ah, give me your go. She must have drop go. I hate it. I hate it. Whatever, let's not get too fussy. Oh, these guys are good. Die, die. I'm not going to die. Hey, I can, I can make it for one If I ever need one more, that's where I'll find Okay. Make my healing cream. Okay. Yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna give you one. I'll have five of them. I've never seen anyone craft new items from mom raw materials before. There's no doubt about it. You truly are the builder of legend. Oh, the goddess smiles down upon us this day. I beg you, F, I beg you, Ephraim, use the powers that you've been blessed with to deliver this land from the blight. No, 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 Broken branches, of course. Now she's going to want me to build an infirmary, which is what I don't like. I don't, don't like how it makes you build something so early in this game. Build something really big with a lot of materials you need so early. I, I should have gotten some. Cotton also. Do you need some cotton Build a house to heal. Yeah, a house to heal. Please take this baby. So it's called Ellie's baby. Where should I build it? Okay, we're going to all this. You know what? I'm going to build it back here. Earth. 
I have 52. I keep smashing this up until I have 64. Hey, will you look at that? I have 64. Truly, the goddess does smile upon us today. Oh, and Ellie is a feather. She throws rocks. Where are those enemies? There's always stairs. Where are they? Where are those enemies? Talking about fights. I have to go. Oh, there they are. They said it's a month ago. I, um, I am. Sorry, Pippa. Let's eat that. Or else I'll technically die of starvation. I really have to build a bonfire. Which grass seed? Then I jumped in the pool. Even though I'm all disgusted. Okay, whatever. Now to get on with this. Now to get on with this class. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna go repair this house. Man, I'm gonna go repair this house, so we have a place to sleep at least. And her HP will get up higher. I am a Hey, I actually like the resident in the corner. Residence maximum HP by 10. What's that? Tonight time. Why weren't you sleeping, Ellie? She just slept. You would have had 10 more maximum XP. Ah, we're already 13 minutes in, and we are still on the second thing. And can you stop making the noise, humming? Do you want me to explain it to you? Starting the new series, Dragon, Dragon Quest Builders. No, what is it supposed to be? I asked the question. The infirmary building the beginning. Building the infirmary. In the beginning. Mm Part where I said 13 minutes in. Well, her recording was 13 minutes in, but probably there's going to be a couple of guts, so it's not. It was probably not 13 minutes in yet. Might be for you, because I don't know how long my cuts are going to be and how much cuts I'm going to do, but. Still. I'm leaving a lot of these. No! And yet, this music. Yeah, I'm forced to enjoy it. This is one of the swamp with the weird plants. I know. It is like, right. It's the one with the weird plants. What the one with the crabs? What do I want? Of course! I forgot to get caught in. I'm gonna need to. You you need to when you go here. If you want to, you you technically definitely need to get some cotton and some butter beads while you're at it and on sticks. Yeah. Seriously. Hey, baby. I'm an idiot. Jump. What the? Stupid ivy. Stupid ivy. It keeps ruining all my plants. <sighs> God, you know how I like Oh, I'm attacking you too. Yeah, he poisoned the ones. These are the ones that poison you. Blue ones poison you. Yeah. 
Yes, I can cook for you. To get more farm more sticks. Oh, the worst, right? Am I right? First bomb fire. I'm on my way to making a cook fire. Fire roam, whatever it's called. I think it's just my kitchen. Whatever. We're back. And I finished this kitchen. How does it look? I mean, I'm layering down everything, so I'll double with that one. Too, so. You can get one. Leveled it down. And you take care of your belly, please. Thanks. And just come and sleep and. Now I know why he's not There we go. Now we just completed our bonfires. Now to go get some sticks. Dang it. Nice. Okay, whatever. Okay, I'm just gonna go to sleep. Pizza's here. Got ya. Ugh, stupid dumb and jokes. So stupid. I didn't call you stupid, I said stupid dumb jokes. Ugh, okay. More enemies! Yay! Yay! Okay, I'm gonna do my die! 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 die. die. I don't like her. Why are you talking about a stupid TV show called Bunk? So? Seriously, I'm trying to record here. I'm not delusional. Okay. We are back. And... We are coming here to make my, what is it called? Dipper bread. I can only make one. Great. I have four already. I just need two. Okay. I can finish this. Okay, now I need a wash. Oh, you're, you're kidding me, right? I have to head out of town. I'm gonna make this in a farmery. You end up needing six beds, so. Eh. 
First of all, I want to say all that. Okay, we'll do all those adjustments after. But I'll come back to you when this whole entire thing is finished. Is finished. Okay, we are back. And that took longer than I expected to get all the materials. Well, now, let's place this on top and see the great thing that happens when we do. Oh! Yeah, that, that took like 10 minutes to get all the materials, so, okay. Oh my! Praise the goddess! It's just like I, it's just as I'd always imagined. Thank you, my lamb. I don't know how I can possibly repay you. Ephraim, our lives are but fleeting things. There are many people who think it's good to do something. Many of those who fall ill do not believe that they have the strength to win the battle with the plague. They all abandon all hope and wait in science for the Almighty Mother Rune to collect them into her all loving arms. But I have hope, believe, I know these people have the strength and courage to need to emerge victorious. And now that you've built us a secret room, you and I can work together to free the great shepherd and his flock from this accursed blight. Well then, now that's, that's decided, let's... Hmm? You will help me, won't you, Ephraim? Tell me you will! Okay, now. The exact things I almost died for getting from that poisonous blade of Oblivion. Really, you will help me, Ephraim? Rufus be praised for sending me such a willing disciple. I beg you pardon? You didn't say anything. I don't see it. Forgive me. I. Well, that's. I always. I always skip them because I already know what you said, so I'm just gonna not skip them for you. I fear I was so caught up in the excitement of the new sick room. I only heard what I hoped to hear. Be but be but, but, but that be that as it may. Have after the wonderful work you did with that room, I have another request for you. Now that we have a sick room for the ill and injured, we must do great. I don't know how to pronounce that word. And we must bring them here and help them to get better. Some time ago, I saw a man who had fallen ill with the blight a little way out to the west. Alas, I didn't have the medicines I needed to soothe his troubles. Though he may be too weak to walk, Ephraim, I'm sure a strong fellow like you would be able to carry him. Please, my lamb, use your compass to find this poor soul and lay him to rest in this sick room. No one you get this way. I'll take a few more beds in the sick room because they burn. I know. Mm. See, that's a, that's what I'm planning to do. Yeah, I'm planning to do that. Take more beds in your And no, there it hasn't. There's no. I discovered all of the things, and there's also the hospital. Okay. Now to create my last two beds, I want to make. And come here. Some places. Some places. I call it my hospital for the sick. Because you need eventually six beds, at least five beds in here. And I just think it looks better on six. See? Does that look better? Okay. Okay, now lighten, lighten things up. I'm going to place the torches there. And I'm going to have to go and make another bonfire if I want it to look good. that I want to create you, Ellie, a room. Or you sleeping. You need sleeping rooms, okay? You need sleeping rooms. You need to be able to sleep. Or else the ghosts and ponies will get to us. Oh, it'd be much easier if I was switch the wallet. No, I don't want it there. Today, I want it there.
Yeah, I distract him. Thanks, Dave. Well, I make us a room. Let's see how they have your little crate. Now I can cook an egg. How do you make it her room? I'm not going to make it her room. It's just going to be a room for all my guests to sleep in. Here and make a door. Yeah, yeah, door. A door! Yeah, yeah! Why aren't you cheering, Ellie? I literally just made us a place to sleep in. Well, not yet. Yeah. Seriously. Now, yeah. Seriously. Snail in the corner. That rusty old snail. <gasps> just, just look at the finger pointing to the snail. You'll see the snail. It's a snail. Elliot. From his pained expression, it looks like he lost every ounce of his strength. It seems he suffers from the same sickness that affects so many of him. Some slowly waste away until they grow so weak they perish. Others cough even more severely until they can't even breathe and succumb that way. And now there's the disease eats away at them from the inside until, all, until their very bodies rot and fall apart. The vile contagion spreads in so many different ways. But we need not to find, well, we need not to find a cure for every form of that illness just yet. For now, Ephraim, all I ask is that you help me save this one poor soul. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, what? Seriously? <gasps> Do you see me in front of me? Sorry, I didn't get on top of you, Ellie. Ellie, Ephraim, my lamb. There is a reason the blight runs around. 
Ram Pam. I always have So. What's that bad? So. There is a reason the blight runs rampant through Mulder. It is all due to the Hades Condor, who rules the roost over this area. Hades Condor is the boss fight. So. If we ever wish to see the skies clear, which you'll see me fight in the very last episode of this series. Hades Condor. If we ever wish to see the skies cleared or the poison purified, this demon bird must be slain. If it's said that the root cause of the blight that grew from Moldar is the fell rain that the cave condor summons forth. So by bringing that to an end, what's that you say? Shouldn't we help that patient before we start dealing with the root cause? How right you are, goddess, forgive me, for I am a wretched sinner. I've let my anger towards the monsters get the better of me. Ephraim, we must see our, to our new patient immediately. Judging from his symptoms, it seems that illness is still in its early stages. We can restore his vitality and should be able to recover by his own strength. A pouch or two of medicinal herbs should be enough to get him to the road of recovery. I shall watch. I shall watch over our poor patient and make sure his condition isn't too late. Would you be as kind to prepare and administer the medicinal food? Talk. What are we talking about? Okay, I talk! Yeah. yeah. Whatever, I'm gonna go out and get the medicinal food. Well, it's a bit simple. And most importantly, eat them right now. Fill my hunger bar. Okay, okay. You, you still are cooking anything? Oh, you gotta be more useful. I think Nash will cook stuff for you. Guy, patient. Patient. Oh, patient. His name is Nash. Totally. He said the name's Nash. Do I see the women? Just as I always said, I should see the women. And which is what I'm doing. Okay, after six, we got to be enough. Hey, now we have light illuminated on us. Side change, I think so. Okay. Now I go here and create a chill. Twist. 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 Make a twist. A twist. A twist. And if I open my twist, we want to put away. I want to put away that. 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 Okay. Now we full on our ingredient. Oh, I'll make a good way to put away two more things. That and that. There we go. Need medicinal herbs. I know that we need a medicinal herb. Stop saying that. Okay, we go back up here. We get all two medicinal herbs. Well, one of them is for me. One of them is for him. He should know I'm being this grateful because I mostly give it to him. Ooh, Nash is fully cured. Oh. Ephraim, you've given our patient the medicine he so desperately needed. God be praised. His symptoms should start to subside soon. All he needs now is good night's sleep and finally be fed to the However, I am, I fear that our battle with the blight is only just begun, and I don't know what horrors you will see before it's ending. Okay. Three. 
our first patient symptoms were part particularly mine. I can only pray that the other ones will be so easy to cure. Ah, oh, but forgive me, I'm getting ahead of myself. I should instead be praying that our patient makes a speedy recovery. Remember, Ephraim, that when we treat um a patient, they'll still need some time to recover their strength. I imagine most pa- patients will recover with a good night's sleep. There's no harm in getting some sleep yourself when you're getting ahead. And you have another quest for me. Yeah, how does it? See, he'll, he'll be he'll be good. He'll be good. He'll be good one time. Go to sleep. See, he's good. He's good. Look, he's good. He's going to my flag like a pro. Feeling right as rain. Woohoo, I'm back to my old self again. Thanks for saving me. I never knew the boy could actually be cured. Honestly, I was convinced that falling ill with the plague was a death sentence. When I got sick, I thought it was just a matter of time before I bit the dust. Thought that I might actually get better, never crossed my mind. And <laughs> little did I know that a nun with the face of an angel and a builder with the face of a potato would nurse me back to health. You're brilliant, Ephraim. Both of you are. Is it okay if I stay here? I just know we're gonna get along. Oh, and here, take this. It might not be much, but it's the least I can give you for saving my life. Hey, that is much. That is much. My max XP at crease. So I'm at like a 40 max XP. I'm here. What are your next best for me? I'm from my land. I'm so lucky that the goddess sent you to me. And I'm luckier still that you built me the sick room I have always dreamed of. I want to make the most of this opportunity and we offer the best possible treatment to all poor souls who need my aid. If we are to defeat this accursed disease, we shall require the finest medicines available to mankind. Unfortunately, I don't know the first thing about taking med- making medicine. But hope is not lost, my lamb, for upon a plateau it, to the south lives Gerotius, the famous herbalist. Would you be as kind of fetching for me? He's a very bird man, and he knows how to make all kinds of tinctures, salves, and ointments. With his skills as a herbalist, your powers as a builder, we, sh- we sure, we sh- I'm sure we could create a culvert tip to cannibal itself. I'm sorry, why don't I go and tr- fetch him himself? Myself, I just can't help it. Sometimes I be so, sometimes I be so rude. I mean, look at me. Just look at my eyebrows. Let's see. He's a fierce, some stubborn man, Ephraim. If anyone can convince him to join us, it's you. Besides, if I were, were I trying to talk to him, things could get very complicated. I don't really know how my turn out. So please, Ephraim, follow your compass to find Gerotius and convince him to come back with you. Okay, now we go. We have to go that way. Let's go this way. But right now I have more important things to do. I can sell my ways like build stupid gravestones. Because you need to build gravestones, so it's best. Anybody else playing on this quest? It's best if you bring your thing. Your, your um workstation with you. On this quest. Yeah, we did our thing.
Yes, I am too, Tears, but who in the world are you? What? Whoa, whoa, what? You're the builder? Oh. And Ellie sent you to find me? Haru, if that's the case, then you are wasting your time, young man. I no longer have the will to help her. There is still one more soul I must put to rest, but I have not even the simplest wooden memorial to honor this memory. Please, just leave me alone. Okay, now I'm going to make a wooden memorial for him. Oh, yes? It seems you really are the legendary builder. What exactly has that girl made you agree to? She's put ideas in your head about working together to red to cape the play, hasn't she? Listen to me, young man, you can't fight death. It's the natural order of things and you're just gonna have to accept it. Man is the only creature in parentitians to enough to escape death itself. Doesn't that strike you as foolish? Absurd, even? Okay. Haru, that makes us what's human, is it? You're though a lot cleverer than you look possible. Very well, let's return to your settlement. I want to see how just how much you and Ellie have to plot this bird. Now, that is where we'll leave off on this episode. Bye, guys! Oh, bye, and have a great day. You too, and subscribe to the channel. Okay, stop.